Hello everybody, my name is Mad Muhammad and welcome back. Well not welcome back, but welcome back to another video. And today we're gonna be playing a game called Tetris. Uh, and I may not have my headphones in, so I, you may or you may or may not be able to actually hear the music. Not that you wanted to. No. But Tetris, if you do not know what it is, because you're a 2000 kid and all he plays phone night. Tetris is a game where you have these little blocks and you have to try and put them together. And sometimes, and then like if you get a full bottom part connected, it goes down. If you get to the top, it's gonna just, you're gonna lose. That's how you lose the game. It's pretty easy, so let's get it. Okay, uh, for some reason I guess I cannot change that. Okay, I'm offline now. It just got to So we're gonna do Marathon, which I'm pretty sure that's the original. I'm gonna do Swipe Difficulty 1. I'm not a noob. Let's get it. Two, one, go! So, so I have played this before. When I was very, here's a story. When I was very young, before YouTube, that's how young I was. And I would play Tetris on my Xbox 360. Yeah, on Xbox 360. I still have it to this day. So that would be 15% off of 2750. Uh, it's a, but it wasn't really the actual Tetris, it was more of a demo Tetris. So... Yeah, it's still, but it's still, the game was still normal at the time. I actually, I didn't know how to play. I still didn't know how to play. My mom had to go ahead and show me how to actually play the game. Thanks, mom. And yeah, that's basically what you do. And if you make it to the top of the, of it, you kind of die. No, not kind of. You actually die. So I think I'm, I think I'm doing pretty good. And also the difficulties just do how fast. Yo, your blocks go. The highest difficulty makes them go crazy. But okay. Let's put you. Okay. And let's put this right there. I think I'm a mild Tetris player. This is actually a very old game. It's like one of those classic games that people remember. Okay, the good thing about this one is that if you don't have it, you can put it on hold. This is a new mode that was added to the mobile to mobile version, not British. I just like saying mobile better. And it's a lot... Oh, God. Okay. Oh, yeah, and you can't change it back after. I learned that the hard way. Oh no, I messed it up. Uh, okay. Oh god, I messed it up. Uh, let's, let's just... Yeah, the problem with Tetris is that there's so many mess ups that's unreal. So people are always like getting really mad like, Oh god, I messed up Tetris. I'm gonna die now. Like that. <laughs> But Tetris is like one of those calm games that you play when you're angry. Like if you're angry, Tetris. If you if you feel bad, Tetris. You don't play Tetris, Tetris. Oh god, I messed it up again. I feel like Tetris is like one of those games because it's really hard to make a video on it because you can't. Because you're mostly trying to, because it's one of those strategy games, so you're most likely strategizing of how you're going to play it. And then, when you actually do, so let's bring this back in. There you go. Then I can do this. I got a combo. I feel like one of those games would be like, oh, okay, I gotta come. Like one of those like online games to be like, oh, I got a combo, yeah, yeah. I'm so good, no. 
That's not what I am. I don't do that. I think, well, I think I don't. This there. Wait. No, on. Dang it. I messed up. Honestly, I don't know why this is like that. It's just like a little glitch. So let's do that. Um, there you go. Perfect. Ah, oh, you messed it up again. This is the game. They're actually very... It's kind of addicting. Not addicting at Fortnite, I don't play Fortnite. I'm not one of those gamers. We go look at Fortnite all the time. No, um, I'm a mine. I call myself a Minecraft YouTube channel. However, I don't just play Minecraft. I play a variety of games. It's just Minecraft has just been one of those games that keeps on coming back. And I'm also in a mall. But if you hear people, just remember, I'm in a mall. And they're like, oh, okay. I'm not at my house. I, I just, my mom was doing something, so I'm all like, I want to make a video. I don't care I'm making a video. When you, when you have to do something, you keep your fans anticipated. Even when it's screaming, and you probably can't even hear me right now. Oh no, damn, whoo! Go on, let's do this one. Okay. There you go. I'm gonna die. Okay, we did that. Oh no. Oh no. God, this is. I need to get something straight. Or else it may be goodbye. No. Okay, I did something. Game over. The game is done. Ugh. That's it. Thank you for watching. See you guys next time. But no, I'm just kidding. We're not in the video yet. Because there's one more mode after the ad stop. There's one more mode that is new to Tetris. Marathon is like the OG original, but this one's called Galaxy. You basically do a bunch of levels, and once you finish all the levels, you um, you connect the docks pretty much, and you make something. The first time it was like a shooting star. Once again, I already played this game. So here you have to break all the blocks using Tetris. And this is also a new game mode, which I do not like. Basically, uh, it gives you all the availables so you can do it. But I feel like then that wastes your time. Because then the whole point of Tetris was to strategize and like you'd be like oh god I need, I need to do it like this and then ending up you have this game mode that's like so OG I mean I can understand for the people who just started playing Tetris but I mean what okay we did something those are the power ups which are also new I got a mini spin tackle out with it I and also, just to tell you, I'm one of those YouTubers yeah, who, like, because, like, at the beginning of people's YouTube channels, they probably, like, are so, so shy, and, like, they, they've, they've, it sounds, they don't like how their voices, and, like, when they go back to watch the first video, you're like, whoa, I sound like that? Oh, uh, no, that wasn't with me. I was totally different. With mine, I actually, oh, God, I messed up. Let's retry. No, and with mine, my first video, and I can say it was a little dull, but I'm not talking about the Treasury Arena one. That one isn't actually my first video. My first video showed my face. It was just like a little intro. At the time, I didn't know how to do a lot of stuff. Like, I didn't know how to do simple things like editing. But then, and then like, but the funny thing that in, my, in the next video, 
boom! It's like I blew up. I started like talking like crazy. I think it's because I'm, I'm, I'm a loud guy. I'm pretty sure everyone right now is like, who the heck is going on with them? But you understand. Because when you have the, a job as a YouTuber, you do this for a living. I died again. You do this for a living. And, well, mine will be for a living because I haven't put ads up to my channel. And without ads, I don't really make YouTube money. So we're going to play Marathon. This is the one I was talking about, the one touch. But I do swipe. I'm going to do this again. Okay. So we're going to do a... No, we're going to do back one. <laughs> no, but some people's jobs are actually this. And if you didn't know, YouTube is a job. People do this for a living. It sounds crazy. It looks crazy. But it's true. People do YouTube for a living. And they make money off of this. Those ads that you think are annoying. Just remember, people are making money off of this. People are paying people to make them money. What? And just I do not do scripts. Which is why everything I'm saying doesn't sound right. And also what has I said? And also I do not actually just like I don't stutter. But if I do it's usually because like oh say. You know, so just to tell you the subtitles are wrong. If you are deaf and you hear subtitles. Um, remember that the subtitles are actually, um, since I have a speech, imp I don't call it a speech impediment, it's pretty much, um, I can't say my R's correctly, you probably noticed that by now, got some life stories up in here, no, um, actually I'm still in speech today, no, but besides that, um, I guess because of that, it makes me sound a whole lot different, Oh, the subtitles make me sound different. And somehow it even managed to do my theme song. I wonder if I can turn off the subtitles. Can I? I don't know. I am going to die. You know, just kill me. Because I want to try something else. Okay, there we go. We ended the game. So we ended the game. Let's try it again. But this time, shut up, no one wants to play you. You're an educational oh, yeah. game. I mean, maybe some certain educational games like Prodigy are really good, but others, not so much. Okay, so. Yeah, it's a little going a little fast though, but not that fast. So we're gonna do this again. So we'll do this. Let's do this again, there we go. Get my head back into the game. Let's do this. Yes, I'm getting good at it. This is really actually. I know this is not really hard. I mean, some chips would be like, oh, I play 10. But guess what? I don't care. Tetris, Tetris isn't really like one of those competitive games. I mean, you can make it competitive. Like if you want to be all like, oh, I play, I play better than all of you combined. That's post sportsmanship. Not lying. That's physically and mentally post sportsmanship. And I know some people will take it out of the challenge, be like, oh, I'm better than you. Let's do it one by one. I'm fat. No, no Tetris. But once again, Tetris is one of those games that no one really remembers because it was made back. Because I mean, Tetris, I don't really say it was ahead of its time. But I feel like compared to Tetris, because Tetris was one of those simple games. It wasn't really a game that was meant for competitive. And then the creator saw how people got competitive. Like, we should make it competitive. Yeah. Good job, you won me. No, but that's just like the old version was very calming. It, I mean, maybe you would get mad sometimes if you lost, but that wasn't really the main deal of Tetris. Tetris was like one of those games to have fun and play with your friends. But the problem with this game is that 
with this touch with Tetris, it was too calming. So too calming for the fact how games, because at the time games were really, I say, I take it back. It was ahead of its time because now we have so much common games, and that wasn't really like it. People were into action games like Mario and Zelda and Fortnite. No, that hasn't came out yet. No, but the joke is that people, this was such a common game that it pushed back. Nobody really expected it. It was one of those games that be like, huh, I never expected that. And now on the Google Play Store, we're finding more common games like Helix Run, or, or Duck Life, or Red Ball. They have the resemblance of strategy mixed in with, with like kind of anger, but at the same time, we have to remember that it's a game. Unlike, because some games now are taking it way too far with the getting really mad because we have games like Fortnite where you don't even, you can pause. And Minecraft does the same thing. Even though you can pause the game, you, nothing pauses. You can play again. And like with the game, you just have to, people are like forgetting that it's a game. It, with these kinds of games that are now being more developed and more round round, well-rounded people are like be are getting calmer they're not raging because like the games here are smooth they're not competitive it's i feel like the developer did a real i feel like whatever the developer's dream was it got it because they had the feel of strategy and raging but it also had the feel of calmingness like, you can see that I haven't raged a lot in this video. But that's just because it's a game. It's not one of those games that's like, oh, God. And, like, the, like oh, God, I'm not going to be able to. And also, this game doesn't, it's a, it's a free game on the App Store, Google Play. It's a, this free game is, also, it's not like one of those games. I mean, Helix One is a good game. I play it all the time. But the... It's kind of like giving you a little bit of insanity because they're telling you that if you get this much, they'll give you a prize. I know that kind of sounds like a good thing at first, but just remember that this is a game. It doesn't matter. Okay, now I'm going to end this game right now. Because it was getting too long. I talked so much. Ugh. But anyway, that was my interpretation of Tetris. Once again, it's like a calm game. If you do like it, please do like. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.